so tell us about what happened. Uh, you guys got the old email and got caught up to the big leagues for Ugh. for a music video. So, <laughs> so, so tell us about that. We were just talking about this last night, actually, yeah. about how that all unfolded. Yeah, because we're talking about uh, licensing footage. So yep. there's a lot of people that want to license this footage because it's authentic stuff. Yeah. yeah. You know, uh, there, there'll still be people in the comments that say, fake this fake i'm like wow what would the budget be if that walk of larry walking to the thing what would that budget be we would have to rent all those old cars and drive them around we'd have to stock that entire convenience store Mm -hmm. and put the cigarettes up front you know oh yeah exchange the uh, the 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 machine you know anyway but a record store that doesn't exist anymore would have to be built be there yeah Yeah. but anyway (laughs) Um, sorry, that was a rant. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> it's not fake, okay? How do you feel about it? <laughs> you know, screw you, you about guys. It. <laughs> anyway, um, but anyway, so yeah, a lot of companies want to uh, license our stuff. So you know, documentaries, yeah. commercials, just all kinds of stuff. We're, we're in the midst of right now. I can't say who, but yeah. it's a documentary that wants you know a couple seconds of a, of a video. So we just signed an agreement. So it's an Ooh. ongoing thing, which yeah. is pretty cool. Most of them, I'd, I'd say, fall through, but the ones that you know work are pretty cool. And usually, um, they're just like you know, they want a few snippets. And, yeah, you know, right. Real short. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> so, um, yeah, I guess one day one of those companies was Nickelback. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's you know? awesome. And we're kind of intrigued. Actually, you, yeah. T- uh, Say what you said to last night. We had the same conversation. Yeah. We did. And yeah. We went to a bar last night over a beer, and you were. We anyway. get this. We get this email. From Nickelback's management. Right. And I'm like, eh, really? You're like, damn it, it's Charlie again. What's <laughs> <laughs> up, so, Chad? It's Charlie. <laughs> <laughs> hey, this is Gene Simmons. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I I was weary from the get go. I was, nah, I don't know. I this might not work out. And right. so um first conversation with them i i pretty much just told them no thanks we're not interested yeah but their comeback was like they really liked our stuff and they really wanted to use it and they understood like how we were being a little like worried about well are we trying are yeah. they trying to steal our footage are they right. trying to like you know, own it or whatever. Well, and, you, like, and you were wary because of the complexity, right? We're like, we're, we're, we don't have lawyers. We yeah, don't have all this exactly. Stuff, so, you know, like I we're mean, not a big company. We we can't afford to like, yeah, you know, hire lawyers to look at all this. Yeah. Stuff so over. so, so Daryl gives me a call. And, hey, <laughs> that's true. You look over this agreement. I literally, I'm in my 20th year of practicing law. I do exclusively criminal defense work. That's right. all I do. Mm-hmm. I don't do contracts. I don't do business. I don't do... It's like, well, I'll look at it, but hell, I don't know, you know? <laughs> yeah. And so he's like, well, do you, do you know anybody? And it's like, well, the guys that do that, you know, those are the, you know, the three and $400 an hour guys. And it'd probably take them a few hours to, res- you know, to review this. Right. And uh, so, yeah, even though they have a lawyer, if they, you know, commit a crime, I can probably help. <laughs> <laughs> but if uh, if they need me to look over the contract or whatever, I'm pretty much useless. Yeah. Right. So it, <laughs> it just seemed way too complex and I just didn't want to deal with it. And 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 every, everyone knows the stigma of Nickelback, right? From the internet yeah. kind of standpoint. Um, not that I really was trying to go there, but I was just like, meh, you know what? Just no. Mm-hmm. But they were like, no, we really love your stuff. Is there any way we can work this out? We, we're happy to like, you know, any of your concerns, we'll meet them. And, you know, and they just turned out to be the, the coolest, yeah, nicest guy. I guess being from Canada, yeah. you know, <laughs> that had something to do with it. But um, I, I do remember it was very accommodating because, uh, you know, Daryl, his first call to me was like, well, hey. You know, what do you think? I was like, yeah, it sounds awesome. And he's like, right. I don't know. And, and you know, and then I was like, well, you know, you do have to be concerned, you know, that you're just licensing it. You're not selling it. You don't want. Yeah. And so, like, every little thing that Daryl could come up with, you know, he would forward me back their response, their email. Okay, we'll add this. We'll take yeah. this out. We'll put this clause in there. You know, not only do we not want to take your stuff. 
you know, we want you guys to continue to promote your stuff, you know, right. and uh, right. we're not trying to, you know, take it from you. It would just be mm. for this purpose. And it did seem like, you know, it did seem like they were going way out of their way to be accommodating to try to yeah, get the, right. you know, the use of the footage. So right. uh, it was cool. They, they, uh, we all wanted to be in a, in a, in a rock video growing up. Nickelback video, who, man. Who would have known that, <laughs> you know, it was going to be decades later, but we would accomplish that. Yeah. yeah that's, that's great. So cool. I, I've heard nothing but great things about that camp, the Nickelback camp, yeah. that they're just yeah. amazing, very accommodating. And I, to this day, I, I love them. I, I mean, well, the, it's not, popular. I, no, it's popular they're, to dislike them. You it's know, popular yeah, to dislike them, but, but it's very unwarranted. I yeah, mean, I think they're, they're one of the good, how, how great songwriters. How, how yeah. could you be have that much hate, but just sell tens of millions of albums? You know what I mean? Yeah, so yeah, yeah, yeah. They're buying it. Yeah, right? well, uh, that was yeah. what I would always say. You know, like back yeah. in the day, it was Michael Jackson's bad. Right, mm -hmm. everybody hated it. Oh, oh it yeah. sucked. I wouldn't buy that. It was like, well, it sold like ten million copies. Nobody's bought one. <laughs> Same thing with Nickelback. Yeah. You know, it's like you know, everybody's like, oh, I hate Nickelback. I don't like Nickelback. I don't like it's, them. It was it's like they sold like fifty million records. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, uh, I've got I've got a friend that's real close to their camp, like two, um, you know, Chad and all those guys, and it genuinely hurts their feelings. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Like genuinely, like oh sure, because they're, absolutely. You know, uh, they're they're putting their art out there, and and it's a it's commercially yeah. successful, and that's what people and, hate about it. And it gets yeah. all this yeah. hate, and it, that the hate though, gen, you know, it's one thing to read a few shitty comments like, oh, that guy said, you know, I had two chins on this episode or whatever, or this or that, <laughs> right. but it's yeah, another thing to have to have like a a <laughs> bunch of people. Just ripping you apart every time you turn around, you know, for putting your heart out. Yeah, and 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 it's just, <clears throat> it, it blows my mind that like those people that like bag them only heard their hits. Oh yeah, listen right. to the record. Yeah, well, it's like hits, you know, I mean, their it's hits just, are great though. They, yeah. Exactly, and that's the only say, thing too. Yeah, they're the like, band that when it comes on the radio, yeah, you find yourself kind of tapping your foot and and bobbing along. Of course, even if you didn't like the song, you know, when it first came out so many years ago, it's like, oh, it's it, what, it's actually pretty good. What you was know? that album yeah. they put out? in like 2008, 2009 that just made them a global phenomenon. It was uh, All the Right Reasons, maybe. Uh, had, had the one with the, How You Remind. Oh, yeah. have, oh wait. No, the, uh, had, no, that was their early you're right. stuff. Had the car on the front of the album. Yeah, yeah, right? yeah. 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 It, it had... Um, it had all their photograph, huge, their rock big, star, yeah, rock star, photograph, yeah, all, yeah all the right reasons. So that's yeah. the album right there that yeah. made them an absolute... So it says it had come out in 05. So absolute just household name. That's a great um, record yeah, from top. Know, and and, and top the whole to record's great. Like, there's mm. nothing. Honestly, um, I've listened to this album, like, front to back. And How many records did they sell of that one? Uh, I, I never thought any of the songs sucked. Yeah. I mean, put, look at this. Side of the Bullet about Dimebag Daryl. That's yeah. actually his guitar solo on that. Yeah. You know, I mean, oh, like, wow, yeah. you yeah. know, and it's like, you sit there and go, like, the heaviest and the most, you know, one of the successfully commercial bands, you know, like they're a family, like they, they were respected and all that, you know, it's like, I, I just, I don't get it. I don't know why, you know, I, I I'll bat for Nickelback. I mean, I, I got their back 1000%. Yeah. I well, know, and I appreciate, you know, I, I can always appreciate any artist or band that, that's still trying to do it. You know, it's yeah. one thing to live off of what you accomplished yeah. in the past right. and that's fine. I don't fault. Uh, you know, I don't fault artists for going out on those tours and, you know, Montley Cruz farewell tour You're number right. seventeen two or three times over. <laughs> right. I think Kiss has been saying goodbye for a couple yeah. of decades Since the now. 80s. <laughs> but yeah. you know, you know, funny thing, the first concert I ever went to was a Kiss and Montley Cruz concert. Was it? Yeah, oh, I wow. think it was like two. I think it was two thousand twelve. That was the uh, farewell tour seventy one. It was the seventy one. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> <That was it. laughs>